What's going on everybody? It's Colton back again with another NASCAR Heat 4 Career Mode episode. Uh, we're going to go to Pocono this week, Trick Triangle. Uh, looks like we're only going to have 40 laps. Uh, looking at the current standings right now, we only have a one point lead on Denny Hamlin. Uh, but we're still, like, like always, we're locked in the playoffs with two wins. Um, seeing who can lock their way in would be Kozlowski, Harvick, Elliott, Suarez, Blaney, Byron. So let's keep, their eye, keep an eye on those guys, see if they can get a win and uh, not have to point their way in. But uh, we're going to go back to our original paint scheme, and uh, we will see you out there at Pocono. We're live from Pocono Raceway for the Pocono 400. The tricky triangle is different than any other track these drivers will encounter all year. So nailing the setup of the car is crucial. Which of these teams will unravel the mystery that is Pocono? Let's go find out. All right, everybody, here we are at Pocono. Uh, we got Paul Menard. He's not looking too good. Clint Boyer is going to be coming after us today, and then our rival of Kyle Larson is going to be starting in the back. Uh, we qualified P22. I don't know if we'll be boosted up one because of Kyle Larson, but, um, yeah, we qualify about the same spot every single race. But um, here we go. Uh, Pocono is going to be a difficult race for me just based off of qualifying. Um, going to take a few laps for me to figure out the turns, uh, especially – Play on the difficulty I'm not used to, and um, one thing I almost kind of wanted to address is on my last video, there's some, uh, I wouldn't say a negative comment, but, hang on, someone trying to get my attention saying that uh, I need to learn how to drive, you know, yada, 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 and my answer to that is I, I don't like any negativity on my channel. I try to be more of a, or as positive of a person as I can be. And outside, I just look at that outside. as a suggestion, Hold like anything line. else. Um, but with that, just to say a few things, I, I want you to keep in mind, like, this is the first time ever I've played on Legendary Difficulty. Car and it's also line. the first Careful. time I've ever tried commentating or talking while I'm playing. So this is all new to me. Um, I'm just here to have fun, like, I'm, no more than that. Uh, I just, I, I'm having fun playing a video game that is of a sport that I really enjoy. And, yeah, my drivings might not be the best, but I just really hope that, um, together we can, like, just have fun. Um, like, I'll probably get into the wall a few times, I'll probably spin out a few cars here, but, uh, it is what it is at the end of the day. Um, it is a video game, and I enjoy it, and I enjoy this YouTube channel. It's something that I'm just looking at doing for fun and uh, hopefully it grows into something a little more than that and uh, we can all have each other's back and just you know be positive in the in the uh, in the comments oh, did I already get loose alright that's my one so uh, whatever your name was I did that for you um, driving's not the best as usual but um, it's okay. And then another thing, uh, one of the suggestions I had in my comments too was also that maybe instead of cutting out the boring parts, I could look into um, speeding up uh, the boring parts. So you guys get to still, still see the race and I can just fast forward a little bit. Um, I don't know if what I use allows me to do that, but I'm going to look into it. And uh, so this video, I'm gonna record the entire race. It might be a little unconventional, um, not not to what you guys are used to, not to what I'm used to, but we're gonna give it a shot um, and see see how it goes. Might be a little longer than normal because of it, but that's okay. Clear high, bud. You're all clear up top. But uh, yeah, it's not not the easiest track. And you know, it's not the easiest game. I, did, I didn't even start playing the Heat series until the end of last last season's edition. Careful, still there. All right, you're clear. I think I do have a pretty good car. It's just a matter of controlling um, controlling the corners. Still there.
last season on turn three, whenever I would hit that uh, darker area in the apron, which I, I would do it almost every lap, I would consistently spin out. Okay, I got a good gap in front of us now. Oh, stage ended. I feel like we still had four laps left. I don't know why the stage ended so abruptly like that. I mean, it's fine, I guess, but we're just going to do right side tires, I guess, since we just came down not too long ago. And we're going to have to pit again during the stage anyways, unless we get a caution, I think. Cool. Yeah, so we came out 11th. Um, two rivals right in front of us. I'm not liking the look of that. And then I think we got Truex right next to us. I was looking at all the other teams. Joe Gibbs Racing, man. We are in the red on everybody. We are rivals with everybody except Truex. So I don't want to build up this rivalry even more with this team. See, Hamlin's giving me the block. Power outside. Hold your line. Got one down low now. He's spinning out. I just got somebody got in the back of me. It's like Kevin Harvick. Yeah, I'm surrounded by rivals right now. This isn't isn't good. Coming through here is not gonna be very fun three wide. So I apologize to that guy in my comments in advance. I apologize. Hold your line, three wide. Tight. I said this channel is nothing competitive. It's just just me having fun playing Coming this game. The green, driver. You ready? Car down the and you know, if anybody does have an issue with things that I do, I definitely definitely do want to know. But just you know, don't come at me in a negative way. Like if you're gonna come at me in a negative way, then why don't you just go out there and make a channel and just do it better? That's all you gotta do. Careful, still there. Got Chase Elliott in front of us now. Bubba Wallace is up here. He's having a pretty good day. Still there. I really want to get a get a wheel. Inside. You're all clear but it's just unfortunately it's not in the budget right now. And editing software is not in the budget. Elgato capture card is not in the budget. Got a car high now. Got a car low now. Jesus. Inside. flag coming out um, I don't even think we need fuel but I'm just gonna come down and, and fix everything get four tires fill up, fill up the gas tank and uh, go from there yeah I only lost one spot doesn't look like Chase is having the best day coming to the green driver be ready here Green down let's go <laughs> But uh, beginning next season, I'm going to implement some sort of a uh, penalty for damage. Uh, kind of like Gary Gary Owen does on his channel, where if he hits a certain amount of seconds worth of damage, um, it'll you know, give him like a lap penalty, two lap penalty, DNF. So um, just to make the game a little little more challenging for me and hold me hold me a little more accountable. But I don't want to implement that mid season, so that's why I'm going to wait till next season. Bottom's looking good. Got one inside. I've got in my teammate. Because I need to learn to drive. <laughs> inside. 
side. All right, you're clear. Bottom free. Use it if you need it. Looking inside now. I feel like this and this, uh, like, next four string of races are going to be tough finishers for me. Hold your line. Got one inside. Can't remember where we're going next. But I know Sonoma's on here, and I almost don't even want to record that one. I might put that, I'll make that episode a two race episode just so I can show you that I finished last place at Sonoma. Kozlowski's still out in front. He's having a pretty dominant race. Gonna push from Daniel Hemrick. Hopefully we can get underneath Newman here. Cross us right back over. There you go, I executed that corner pretty well. About time. Careful, still there. Up oh, someone's wrecking up front. No point at that stage. Let's see how it is. Looks like Tyler Reddick. Kozlowski with another stage win, so he's racking up the points. Come down and pit. Go ahead, fix up everything, get some fuel, and we're gonna come down through stage three. Didn't even check where I finished last th last time. I think I finished P19. Daniel Hamrick's underneath of us now. Uh, so is Ryan Newman still. Um, I've been trying to race a little more conservatively. That might it might be uh, okay. Larson got in the back of us. Might be a little more aggressive here towards the end of this stage. Uh, might might go full send. Because again, it's just entertainment. Yeah, Larson's worked his way up all the way from 40th to 21st, so he's having a pretty decent day. Careful, still there. Clear high, clear high. He's gonna put the block on us. Car outside, hold your line. There you go, bud. Got a car low now. I think I'm gonna title this video, You Need to Learn to Drive. I think it'd be fitting. Coming to the green, driver. Be ready. All right, I will have about a half a lap fresher tires than everyone, so we'll see how that works. Someone's stacking up here. Careful, still there. Clear high, clear high. Car is Interesting. Now. All right, you're clear. You got room. You're clear. Got Byron all the way back here too. I don't know where Bowman is. He might be the only one holding the team accountable right now. You got room for a decent you're clear. finish. I'm just glad that we locked we locked ourselves in because now the stretch of races that we're on right now are going to be going to be tough. All right, clear outside.
All right, we got a caution coming out again. Uh, looks like is that Joey Logano spinning out. Yeah, Joey Logano with a pretty nasty spin up ahead of us. Uh, we're gonna come down to pit, finish off this race. Um, yeah, four tires. We'll get, we'll just fill up on fuel in case whatever reason there's multiple overtime. You know, whatever. Uh, I'm sitting P20 right now. Let's see where we come out. P33. <laughs> so, I think maybe taking that extra set of extra gas and. Uh, Probably did four tires when everybody else did too, so unfortunately we fell back, but I don't know, maybe I didn't think taking all that fuel would, would hold me back because really they're fueling you up once you're while you're uh, taking tires, so hopefully this means my tires are just a lot fresher than every, everyone else's. But this brings me back to my other point on how it would be nice if uh, they had like a pit break breakdown. Um, when you exit pit road, like saying who came off, what the difference was, what they took, like kind of like they do on TV. Stay low. Um, but I would like to see Joey Logano back here. I mean, he spun out and, and got into the wall pretty good. Still there. We're getting loose there. Yeah, yeah our tires are definitely clear. fresher than everyone else's. So hopefully we can use this to our advantage, you know? Still there. All right, William Byron sitting P23. Right, about to be a little bit further back now. Ty Dillon up here. Um, so if you guys could just let me know in the comments if, uh, if you like this new format. Again, I don't know if I'll be able to fast forward at all. I should be able to, um, but if it works, go ahead and let me know if you prefer that or if you prefer the, prefer the old style. Um, general feedback is that my videos are have been a pretty good length. But uh, again, if you think they should be short enough, if you want them longer, uh, let me know. I can always try. Actually, I don't know. I would say down the road I could try doing two races per video, but like shortening up. But it's just really hard with the software limitations for editing. Um, it'd be very beneficial if I had a face cam just so I could like see when I'm talking and versus when I'm not. Because um, what I used to do is like when it got to a boring part, I would pause it. And then I'd race a little bit. When I got a little more entertaining, I would pause it again. So that way, when I when it, the game would pause while I'm editing, I knew that all right during this part I'm not talking, so it's not even worth showing. But I'm gonna see if during instead of up oh, someone's wrecking. back or down. That's Hamlin and Truex. I hope that like damage doesn't carry over. I don't think it does. But again, these drivers should be behind us now. They should not be in front of us. They took damage. Big pile up. Um. So yeah, obviously we're not going to pit, we're going to come back down. Uh, P18. I wish I could see where those drivers were. All right, guess that we had some big here. names in that wreck. Almost ready. I didn't Bring check, we, yeah, we're in a NASCAR Inside. overtime now. Clear down low. Pull on three wide. Alright, this is going to be interesting. I haven't done this turn on the outside lane. Still there. Got one peeking inside. Not too bad, not too bad. Alright, you're clear. Definitely bringing some speed with us now. Elliot's worked his way up here too. Just might drop down below him. Lift it a little bit just so I can get that. Spacing. I don't want to race next to Larson right now. I don't even All care. Hold your line. Got one outside. So what? All I don't clear. even care. Yellow south. Back or down. All right. This is a chance for us to move up. Yeah. You see, Denny Hamlin's up there still. Um. I don't know where Truex is. Truex. They might have put him out of the race. Yeah. He's out of the race. Nice. Again, that, that caution. I wouldn't have been. I wouldn't have been raced that low if it wasn't a rival. Regardless of what I would have done in that situation, if I would have dropped down a little more, if I would have held back, he would have stuck to me like glue. Uh, it's unfortunate that it took out our teammate, but um, you know, I don't really care. I don't care. Everyone's channel is going to have different outcomes and different styles of racing, different styles of entertainment, and I'm going to do what I have to do. Still there. Hopefully we can finish in the points. 
And it might, it might be beneficial now that I took all that, that fuel. We can stay out a little bit longer. Got Tyler Reddick up here. Hold your line. That one is tied. Got a little sandwich going. Not in a good spot right now. Careful, still there. Car on the outside now. Still there. Alright, buddy, give me the spot. White flag is in the air. Well, I guess there, uh, there's no such thing as finishing the points now this late in the race. They're closed off in front of Kurt Busch, right behind our teammate. Who isn't too fond of us right now, so I'm hoping I can get through here without making any contact with him. But then I got rivals galore up here. All clear. And I'll probably spin one of these guys out. Stay low. For myself. Got one up top. <laughs> uh, we officially have a teammate rival. <laughs> I don't care. We finished 10th. Leave it to the last lap for me to spin out in that corner where I said I used to always do. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead, look at the final standings, point standings, and we're gonna go ahead and see if we have a teammate that's a rival. Alright, here we are. We've got a couple videos to watch, so these should be uh, pretty entertaining. I can't believe you, and I support you, and you let me down. <laughs> in fact, you let everyone down. I don't think you have any friends left in the garage. I think it's funny, if you look into his glasses, you can hear, see him uh, reading the script. Like, watch. Someone's holding it right up there. You, and I support you and you let me down. In fact, you let everyone down. I don't think you have any... Ah, uh, compliment him. Matty D. Hey, I know you haven't had the best of luck lately. Don't worry about it. Seriously. <laughs> happens to all of us. There's always next week. Let's turn it around. <laughs> <laughs> I love that guy, but man, he, that acting is, is uh, needs some work. And i pretty sure he finished like near the last place. I finished in 10th, so it is what it is. Uh, thanks, Mike. Appreciate it. There we go. I deserve that one. I'm gonna lie. I deserve every every second of that, but it's it's gonna be weird having a rival that's a, a teammate, so we're gonna we're definitely gonna have to work on that. Um, I don't know. This is what it is. Let's go with the flow. Ah, uh, where's the next episode gonna be? Michigan, nice. Ah, uh, that, that one shouldn't be too bad. Um, looking at the race results, Keselowski won, so he locked himself in, and Harvick was one away. Boyer with a good finish, Reddick with a good finish, and Suarez with a good finish, and then Dylan up there with a good finish. Um, Bowman ended up finishing 12th. I think that's all my fault getting loose on that on turn three. Um, Chase fell back to 23rd, and then William Byron 25th. So, uh, yep. Not the best day, but uh, I mean, it is what it is. Looking at the point standings now, um, I'm actually not in the lead in the points anymore. I'm 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 down to fourth, it looks like, and uh, but going to the playoff standings, I'm I'm down to third. Either way, we're we're gonna lock our our way in. Um, yeah, now we now it's up to Harvick, Chase Elliott, and uh, those are really the two of and, and Blaney was in the playoffs this year. The uh, bigger names to uh, that need to lock themselves in still. Um, but yeah, that's going to conclude today's episode. Again, uh, different different approach to this video and just kind of um, dealing with that negativity and just just uh, just so you guys understand why I made this channel and and, uh, and that I, I really enjoy it and I'm going to keep keep doing it as long as you guys support me and uh, thank thank you. So we will see you in the next one.